Hi, big tractor power fans. I'm out in a northeast Iowa field with a classic tractor from the 1980s, a white 185 that is spreading manure with a Kuhn Knight 8118 Slinger Manure Spreader. We're going to see and hear this tractor at work out in the field, but first, let's talk a little bit about its history and specifications. The 185 was introduced in the fall of 1986 and previewed at farm shows as a new model for 1987. It became the latest generation of Field Boss tractors from White Farm Equipment. The company had first introduced its Argent Silver line of Field Boss tractors in the late 1974. The first generation of those Field Boss tractors are known as the Silver Stripe models. They're easily identifiable for the bright silver stripe that runs down the side of their hood. In the early 1980s, a new generation of Red Stripe White Farm Equipment models were introduced and then those were replaced by the new Field Boss 185 for 1987. The Field Boss 185 was only offered in 1987 and it was to start a new line of tractors from the company that would use CDC Cummins engines. In 1987, the company continued to offer the Red Stripe 2135 and 2155 but the 2180 model that had used a Caterpillar V8 engine for about a decade was replaced by this new 185 horsepower Field Boss 185. The initial production of the 185 saw a decal on the side of the tractor that simply stated Field Boss and the white name did not appear on the tractor. In 1988, the company rolled out the entire 100 series of tractors, which started out with the Model 100 and went all the way up to the 185. The Field Boss name was dropped from the tractor line, and these tractors were simply known as the White 100 series. In the fall of 1988, White Farm Equipment painted up a special edition Model 185 tractor known as the Spirit of Oliver. It featured Oliver's popular meadow green paint, gold trim decals, chrome wheels, and a chrome muffler to draw in customers at fall farm shows to check out the new White 100 series powered by the CDC Cummins engines. The 185 topped the White 100 series lineup and was manufactured at Allied's White New Idea factory in Coldwater, Ohio from 1986 through 1989. It is powered by a CDC Cummins 8.3 liter 504 cubic inch engine rated at 185 PTO horsepower. This tractor features a partial power shift 3x6 over under transmission with 18 forward and 6 reverse speeds. It has a 74 gallon diesel fuel tank and weighed in from the factory at 17,150 pounds. It could be field weighted up to 18,770 pounds. The list price for a white 185 in the mid to late 1980s was $60,999. That was for the two wheel drive models. For customers that wanted to add the powered front wheel assist, four wheel drive front axle, that option was an extra $9,000. I hope that you've enjoyed learning about as well as seeing and hearing the white 185 at work out in this Iowa field. If you'd like to see more videos like this one, I hope that you'll consider subscribing to Big Tractor Power YouTube where there are over 1,000 videos of farm machines in action. If you have any questions or thoughts about this video, please leave them in the comment section below as I try to respond to every post that is made. As always, thank you for watching. 